thanks, Ben. Yeah, you betcha, man. You know, so I, get, I got my claim, and now I got my gold machine. Yeah. We're going to get that happening. Hey, okay, Greg Evans. Thank you. Yes, yeah, sir, man. It's nice to see you, dude. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you could help me out. Yeah, you bet. So you're going to go mining with this stuff, right? Well, it's going to be hand mining to start with for testing. Oh, okay. The gold claim. Yeah. Um, I dig it. Yeah. Well, you can come and dig, and I'll just watch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, man. You betcha. Yeah, but yeah, so we got that, and the chicken coop did well. I only oh, lost one bird. Yeah. Only one. Let's go check out this chicken coop, man. Yep. That's a pretty, uh, this looks pretty thick, too, eh? Well, I'll try to get in it. Yeah, I don't think so, eh? <laughs> I don't think you're getting in there. Huh? Oh, this is sick, man. Well, I started with the uh, I started with uh, cross cut saw, oh, yeah. and it was too much work. Yeah, that's a lot. You of know, work. so we went to power tools like a chainsaw, and then we uh, well, I mean, I used a screw gun. Oh yeah. But it was a lot of work. It took up my whole summer. Yeah, that's a lot of work. It was a lot of work. Oh, I see you got water coming in here now. Right? Well, I got the water system finally figured. There's my knife! Oh! I've been looking for this! Yeah, did you ever find I, the one? I uh... backtracked all day today yeah. trying to find my knife. And there it is. And there we are. It's ah, it's beauty, big. beauty. Yeah, right on. But yeah, I got the water system going. Out of the creek. Got the pipe. I got like 200 feet of line up the creek. To get it, well, yeah, because to get over the bank, like it wasn't working at first. Oh, because it was lower, eh? Because, yeah, the intake was lower yeah, than yeah, yeah. the output. So it took a lot of time and effort to get the, the water system to go. But I got her going. And it works good. It's, eh? it, it works fine. Continuous strain and stuff. Continuous. Yeah. So I went with garden hose. Yeah, here it is. So basically what I did, I had to weight this end. I put a screen on the one end. Actually the screen looks like it's getting clogged up. But it's still running. And had to weight it down. Filtered water for the chicken, nothing better. Oh, it's gotta be a tool, eh? It's, a, it's like a truck that doesn't run. So that's why you bought a fork. Well, <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe we go get some of that chicken there. Hey, if you don't mind, maybe you can get in the creek and clean the filter out, like just take the debris out. Yeah, sure. How do you get in this thing here? Well, I just gotta take it apart. Um, I don't think we want to go in there. No. No. Is it pretty spooky in it's, there? Wow. Well, <laughs> they, they've uh, they've been crapping in there a lot. Oh right yeah. Way. Yeah, we'll have to get a shovel one day. And... We gotta get you guys a chicken. Oh, that's right. We gotta get you one. Our delivery fee, eh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I've been looking for this all day. This thing is not rusted yet. Well, this, this is the most famous knife maker in the world. Really? Lars Fault made that knife. Man. And he gave it to me at a bushcraft symposium in Alberta. Really? 
because he knew who I was from the Alone Show. Yeah. It's a $300 knife, Swedish steel, birch handle, full tang. It, it's the best knife you could ever get. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. So what do you got planned here to get these chickens out of here? What do I mean? Well, you said you want to get a loose chicken out, right? Yeah, no, we just got to take the door off and we'll pick one for you, okay. put it out, and then dispatch it. Sure. Well, no worries. I suggest one of the bigger ones would be better. Look at the talons on that boy, eh? They take bite hard, too. Yeah, yeah, they look pretty tough. They are. I, I just find that, that shooting them is quicker for them. It's less cruel, eh? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> because it's instant. I think when you chop their head, they, they still have something going on. Yeah. I just usually get them in the head with the 22 and it's over in. Exactly. Okay. No more suffering. Eh? Exactly. I don't want, you know what, I don't want anything to suffer. Even a fish. Works pretty good for bushwhacking, eh? Who would have thought, man? Now that's a machete. <laughs> 